Hello, it's me Norm again from MyBeerQuest.com and I knew I told you that um, I was going on the road soon but I thought I'd try to get one more beer in here before I go to Philadelphia and if anybody knows any uh, good places to go for beer in Philadelphia you can maybe comment or e email me at beer at MyBeerQuest.com Okay, well this next beer comes in a big bottle like this. Uh, it's a uh, it's, called, it's from a brewery called The Brewery. It's called Black Orchard. And this is a California beer, but it's a Belgian style ale. It's brewed with spices, uh, wheat, and oats. And it's from south of me, Orange County which isn't quite San Diego, but, you know, San Diego has quite a few uh, really good beers down there, too, if you're not familiar with the area. I've had this beer once before, about two years ago, at a place called the Old Town Pub in uh, Pasadena. I had this on a uh, tap there, and that's the first time I've ever had it, and that's actually the last time I've ever had it. Was, and I, I remember it being really good when I had it on tap. So it's um, 5.7 alcohol per volume. So it's, it's really not a, you know, a big, huge beer. So if I remember correctly, when I had it, it was a dark Belgian beer. I don't really see anything. Looks really good. Uh, really strangely, uh, this is like a kind of a size of a champagne bottle. I think they call it a uh, magnum. Uh, but most of those have corks. This one has a bottle cap. So very strange. It looks like it should have a cork. Have myself a um, Belgium style beer glass. Went a little crazy right there. It's very hot today. <laughs> it's so. Uh, yeah, the foam just went a little crazy. Might have to wait for this to uh, to die down here. Uh, it is a dark um, dark beer. If you can see the color there, I'm not sure if you can. Okay, it's setting. Uh, serving temperature is 45 degrees Fahrenheit or 7 degrees Celsius. I'm not sure exactly how cold this is. I kept it in the fridge, so that's uh, that's good. The uh, the website is thebrewery.com. It's kind of a strange spelling of the brewery. Uh, I'll put it somewhere, maybe across there, maybe across there, uh, there. <laughs> but uh, let me uh, let me give you the spelling. It's uh, T H E, and then brewery is B R U E R Y. Dot com. So, and that's also the name of the brewery. I don't know what, how you would uh, say it. So, the so phone went down. So, before I pour more, I'm just gonna get the, uh, the nose of it. Well, it smells very nice. It smells, uh, you know, uh, much like a uh, Belgium dark beer, uh, kind of like the Delirium uh, Noctum. It's the closest thing I can compare it to. Well, it's a it's a very smooth dark beer. Um, it's it's yeah. It does have that Belgium flavor to it. The spices, not uh, just the way I like them. You know, I don't like oh, I don't always like the uh, Belgian beers, but this is a really nice Belgium style beer. It's smooth. So uh, pretty good. So. Um, yeah, you know, I, I think this is only regional to Southern California. But if you do see it, you get a chance to see it, and you do like the dark Belgian beers, you know, give it a try. Um, especially, it's it's very refreshing right now on this hot hot day, Southern California day. Maybe the East Coast won't be that <laughs> hot. I don't know. Here it's a different type of heat out there. But uh, so until next time, thanks for stopping by. Cheers, I'm Norm. 
and hopefully I'll have some uh, vacation photos to show you. So, <laughs> cheers.